Welcome back to the second video and today I'll be showing you my Sarama chickens. The house is very messy because we just got a new extension. But they won't usually be like this. Neat thing we just sat there. I'll shoot one puck for you. Okay, I'm gonna shoot Nico a puck. Because <laughs> he really wants to. Okay, so this is where the Saramas are. Saramas are basically a tiny chicken. They're one of the smallest chicken breeds, if not the smallest chicken breed. I think they're really fun and they're really easy to look after. So we're gonna go in now and check how they're all doing. We still haven't got the quail extension from the last video. I talked about it a little bit. The quail are still in here. There they are. See? That one with a purple head is very badly injured. If you watched the first video, you would know. Okay, so this is Phoebe. She is very, um, like, she likes people. Mainly me, because I'm the one that comes in here most of the time. Well, there's Chandler, our big cockerel. Let's see if we can get a uh, yeah, cockle for him. There they go, cockle do a do. Quail, let's just check for eggs. Uh, usually the eggs on this side. No eggs. I should, I will eventually do a video on how to keep quail. Um, most people always keep quail, we'll keep them in a decent sized rabbit, rabbit hutch like this. But I think, because quail are like flying birds, we're gonna make something there for them to fly in. And yeah, they should enjoy it, but they just have to sit and wait. Because these guys kept beating the hell out of them. Not a big surprise though, really. What do you want, Silky? This is their just enclosure, an average enclosure. They like to fly, so that's why there's a bunch of branches. This is Chandler, ah, oh, small but big male, big for his species. He's quite a calm in collective bird. I love him a lot. He's He's noisy for his size, but compared to this cockerel over here, he is dead silent to him. We hear him at 5 o'clock in the morning, and he will go on for about two hours non-stop. cock a doo in All the neighbours hate him. Personally, he's probably my favourite chicken, because of his character. Um, we'll talk about him in another video, though. So this is a Sarama, this is a cockerel. <laughs> Cockerel Sarama, very tiny as you can see, not an everyday chicken. If you have chickens, you would know this is a very small chicken. Um, but I want to get in breeding with our females here. He's that's scruff. You see him in the first video, but there was another cockle there. You can get um, all um, these Saramas in. Um, they come in all different shapes and sizes and small sizes. All just different shapes and colours. They had a bunch of different colours there. Awesome looking birds. Easy to look after after and definitely recommend getting a Sarama if you have the space and if you know how to care for them, which you should after this video. Very calm, see he's quite a calm has my hand to jump off in a second. Yep, there he goes. 
I love ceramics. Do you excuse me? I love ceramics. They're probably my favourite chicken species of chicken anyway. He's my favourite character. I'll give you a little uh, see of him right now. It's that scruff in the corner, the loud one. There's a Sarama. Shut up. After. So there's a Sarama. That's probably our second smallest Sarama here. Against a size 4 train uh, croc. Basically. Shut up. The same size. You can do that. He never cockles um, when I'm not here. He's only cockling because I'm here. What do you want? Okay, so that is the end of this video. If you'd like to see a part two of the Saramas, make sure to hit the like button and stay tuned for more scruff and we'll hopefully be getting more, more quail, more birds. I think we might get goats soon anyway. So yeah, just stay tuned with the farm and I'll see you later. Bye.